be out here another day. Got a squad out here. We got handstand work. We got teeter work. We got these rock wall people. We got ankles getting wrapped. Mine too. Getting it done. We starting. Focus. The reps. This is what we do. Team rolling in, get warmed up. 10 minutes. About to get it popping. Let's go. It's already Wednesday, man. It's crazy. Got some pair work going on. We got some trampoline action. So I'm working out because Brian will stop. Must be done. Look at them DMV connections right here. Yeah, DMV you, connections in the streets. You connect, we out here, bro. And he was even asking me why I'm walking, why I'm rocking Baltimore. I'm just saying, bro. I, I thought you were an island boy. You know what I'm saying? I am an island boy. Oh, wow, you're right. You know what I'm you're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. Yeah, where the Baltimore? I was born here, but my soul is there. You know what I'm saying? That's where I found my soul. Hey. In the islands. Hey, hey. Out in these these right. wa <laughs> these watery streets, I guess. No, we don't we don't get down with that. Michigan winter? No, no, that's where I lost my soul. Why are you still here? I don't know. Oh, we all ask ourselves okay. that question. Oh, I'm still in school. Oh, okay. You meant that like as a serious question? You're yeah. Just, you're just trolling right now. I am. Yeah, I'm still in school. Okay. <laughs> and what? Me? Yeah. Uh, religion. Oh. World mission. Hmm? I'm not a seminarian. There is a distinction. There? There is a distinction. What is it? I was never a seminarian. I have He's not a seminarian it. either. Corey, you want to hear my, my great spirit. We are not experience as a seminarian? <laughs> I, Go you ahead. You know how like, the education students are in the bottom of Bell Hall in that little like... You have creepers, don't you? You go down the stairs and you like walk and then it's all the education students. There's stuff, right? seminarian they creepers, sit, aren't there? They sit at the top of the stairs waiting for the education students to be leaving. Tell, tell, tell them this again. Hey. Talk to them. Tell them the truth. What's going on here, Kira? <laughs> I would go to class in like the little Weird. basement of Bell Hall because that's where I got relegated to. It's the basement of Bell Hall. It's a whole building. It says School of Education. We're in the basement. Anyway, and so you walk upstairs and sometimes you'll see some people who you recognize as religion majors and seminarians waiting at the top of the stairs and they try to chat you up as you're leaving. Not me. Because <laughs> he's not a seminarian. No, I told you. You, you, you kind of you're walking with your friend and you're like, oh yeah, nice, nice to see. You. Nice to see you. <laughs> Goodbye. See, see, that's why we're not seminarians. I Things watched, like that. Yeah. Freshman year, I watched one girl get like accosted in the cafeteria. She was oh, like sitting there. That's a horrible word. <laughs> and, this guy came in and he was like a fourth year religion major, and she was a freshman. And he came and he sat down at her table without even asking, and he started talking to her. And I was like, I'm gonna leave. Nah, you, can, you can't be. You can't be out here. The spirit of the Lord told me. Oh I run past that seminary. If, I, if I'm walking past it, I'm not walking. I'm, ah, I'm going for a, night, a late afternoon jog. <laughs> Time to work out. I'm not one of them. Nah, see, you're not, and that's see, that's why that's why we're seminary. cool. See, that's the thing. That's the thing. People who are in the semin in the seminary as students, you would never know that they were in the seminary as a student. That's the difference. Yeah, yeah. Some people, it becomes their entire life and identity. Mm. So wherever they are, that's why they're a seminarian. Dude, you're right. That's the difference. That's the difference, and that's not us. Not at all. Only on paper. <laughs> not even on paper. We 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 kind of resent that. So non-seminarians in the house. All right, we rock that with pride. Students in the seminary, not seminarians. We have an identity outside of that. We did before we showed up there, and we will after we leave. I identify as a business student. I'm a doctoral student. That's I what I identify as. 
As a gymnast. <laughs> and a gymnast. Let's go. go. Boom. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. There's a difference, y'all. Don't get it twisted. My man is back in the building. Oh yeah. Looking, oh, looking mad confident today. That's oh, what yeah. I'm talking about. Oh, yeah. That's <laughs> in shape. Oh, you touched it up again? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's like, cause it, it was like some parts, it was like more elevated and like more hair. Okay. So I had to do that. That's what's up. Oh yeah, it's mad even now. Oh yeah. Good, oh, yeah. good stuff, man. That's what I'm talking about, man. Handling his business. Yes, sir. It's cold now. <laughs> That's true. It's cold. You should have waited till March. <laughs> nah, it's all good. It is what it is. It is what it is. photography and videography pulled that stuff and uh, they told me to try out and uh, I guess I got in <laughs> and and then the pandemic happened and then our season got short cut short and then um, I went about my days and then after the pandemic I kind of had the opportunity to come back actually Brooklyn was the one who kept bothering me to come back it's like you should come back to gym next come back to gym next. and then I finally came back and I'm glad I did. Is there any dish or course? Um, so I'm Filipino, but I love curry, um, especially coconut curry. The more spicy it is, the better. Yep. And uh, you know, lots of rice. <laughs> <laughs> All right, give it up for Ethan. All right. All right. All right. Quick announcement, all right, for those returning, you know we have family groups, that's the thing. So we've been working on family groups, and I have our family groups. So we're not gonna actually do anything with it today, uh, but tomorrow I think we'll do like family group worships. So I'm just gonna call out, just read off your names. Um, if I don't read off your name, come talk to me. I think I got everybody. If not, then we will put you in one. Um, but these family groups are more or less set, so don't expect to get changed. If there's some big reason you think you need to get changed, come talk to either a captain or directly to coach. They'll have to go through that. So, all right, here's your family group. So in Olivia's group, we have Isabella, Elizabeth, Sarah, Fred, Aldrich, Chris, Gordon, and Spencer. 
in Guillermo's group, we have Alana, Emily, Kendall, Ricardo, Shane, Jamie, Jeremiah, and Sound Ryan. He definitely didn't hear me. Um, in Kira's group, we have Anna, Ariana, Jessica, Dre, Micah, Benji, uh, Matthew, and Anthony. In Hannah's group, I have Alina, Abby, Hannah Harris, Benjamin, uh, Kaden, Manoa, and Corey Edwards, so camera Corey. And in my group are the rest of you, which is Caitlin, Carla, Kara, Laura, Eric, Ethan, Oliver, and Lynn. So those are groups. If I didn't call your name, come talk to me. Um, but yeah. All right, guys. Those are your family groups. My thought for today comes from 1 Thessalonians 5, verse 18. And everything give thanks, for this is the will of God in Christ Jesus concerning you. Gratitude is like a muscle. It gets stronger if we consistently give it attention and push it beyond its level of comfort. Conversely, if we fail to exercise it consistently, our ability to be thankful atrophies. It needs to become a habit. The key to living a holy life isn't simply to outbattle temptation at every turn. It's to build righteous patterns in your life. This is achieved through habits. The Christian athlete glorifies God by intentionally building habits in their life that grow the muscle of gratitude. I want you guys to take a second, close your eyes, think of something or someone that you are grateful for. I'll give you a few seconds. Guys, I feel blessed each and every time I'm out here with you guys. I am grateful for each and every one of you, and I love each and every one of you. Thank you so much for being a part of this team, and thank you so much for putting your best foot forward. That is something that I am truly grateful for. Let's have a word of prayer. Dear Heavenly Father, thank you so much for having us here. Thank you so much for allowing us to be able to come together and glorify your holy name. Please be with us as we go throughout practice. Lord, please help us to get into our positions the way we're supposed to. Please help us to pray. Please help us to practice. And please help us to perform well, Lord. Lord, whatever we fail to ask today, you know what's happening in each and every one of our lives. Please work and help each and every one of us with each and every one of our struggles. And thank you so much for each and every one of our victories, Lord. Please be with us today and help us to all put in good work. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. I think that's it right now. Seven, bro. Seven. Man, what you doing working out right before practice? I do the what's, same thing. What's the, like, what's the alternative? I, I do the same thing. What's the alternative? <laughs> you just go to the like, I work out? Nah, you got to be warm. I hear you. 100%. I'm going to get in this too. Hit up stretching now. Just finished up. Five minutes, 50 burpees. It's a good run. We out here. Time to stretch it out. Seven minutes, then practice. Let's go. Some reps out here. There we go. Oh, yeah. Yes, sir. We got FBI's most wanted over here. 
We got. Bro got the prison glasses on. <laughs> That's crazy. A seasoned oh vet. Hey, I wouldn't be surprised to see a mugshot of yours, bro. <laughs> I would see your face there. Surprise. This this man spends a lot of time in the library. Yeah, this this man spends a lot of time doing else. Well, you know, he will spend a lot of time in the in the yard. <laughs> I feel like you spend a lot of time in the basement, bro. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he missed it. Yeah, I don't know if we got that one, Benji. I don't know if we got that one. <laughs> oh! <laughs> he said, nah. <laughs> <laughs> he said yes. <laughs> Just so y'all know, for the record, we are all upstanding and wonderful citizens of this country. We would this never man, do anything. Man, he's something. <laughs> this man just got the freshest cut of all time. Hey. Oh, the camera's already seen that, bro. Might as well shave everything. Hey. Everything. I got, there. I got those curls, my boy. You guys are not curls, bro. It's going to take you about a year until we get back to where you was at. <laughs> More like six months. With, uh, with oil. Oil? The essential oils. Essential oils to essential make your oils. hair grow faster. Okay. Okay. Yeah. We know something about essential oils. On that note, <laughs> good night. <laughs>